Hey folks, in this episode I travel 120 kilometers through the south of France from Castellane to Digne. I find a lake and make a tuna sandwich, climb some mountains, and continue to struggle with my French. So buckle up, it should be a pretty good time. So the plan today we're going to head towards St. Andre les Alpes. It's about 20 clicks. Looks relatively flat on the map, which is interesting. We'll see about that. What a lake, eh? So the neat thing about it is that it's a man-made hydroelectric dam. Crazy. Well, I just keep getting surprised. Well, it's nice and cool in here. Well, this seems like a great spot for lunch. I wish there was a bit more shade, but I don't want to be fussy. Quite a view. I don't know if the color of the water comes across on camera, but I've never seen anything like it. So, unreal, look at that. <laughs> bit squished. I'm thinking I'll have half of it tuna and then half uh, PB&J. Crazy, there's just people casually like hang gliding. <laughs> Tuna sandwich, right home. All right, back on the road. Gonna keep going, I guess. We're gonna do another. 20 kilometers up to Doramot. <laughs> I think I'm pronouncing that right. Doesn't look like there's any real accommodations or anything. Maybe I'll end up going right through it, but that's the plan for now. So there's the first glimpse of the Alps. Yeah, those are some mountains.
Oi! Oh, it's a nice little park. I just did a lap of the uh, kind of the interior here. There's some trails it looks like, but they're pretty rough. It's gonna make me realize that I probably shouldn't take this thing uh, mountain biking on this trip. It's just so different compared to riding on the road with a lot of gear to taking a like rough trail with big rocks. Every little movement is just so uh, drastic and taxing. And uh, you know, it's been so far so good, so I don't wanna like push it with, with uh, any of my homemade components. On the menu tonight, I think I'm gonna do a cold soak of couscous, which is another experiment. I don't know how this one's gonna turn out. Still no propane anywhere. Um, I think I might just embrace it though. It's kind of cool to just pick up something in each town every day. That way it's fresh and I also don't have to carry as much. Well, this is easy to make. Looks like there's a great little campground up ahead here, four kilometers. Pretty cheap and reasonable and be nice to uh, sit back and relax. So that's where we're going. Not a bad view at all. Well, I'm pretty sticky and smelly and all sorts of things, so I'm gonna go shower and uh, just chillax, so I'll see you in the morning. I've got no idea, but it's cool. Well done. Okay, good climb, good descent. Just in the valley here now, gotta make some coffee.
I'm pretty much out of food. I've just got a bit of granola left and I guess all the couscous and oatmeal, but I don't really feel like having that for lunch. So we'll do uh, another 10 clicks here down to Barem. Looks like they have some uh, restaurants and places to sit and stuff, so should be a grand old time. Je voudrais uh, le la pita kebab. Pita kebab. Oui. Do you uh, want it with the side salad and the uh, French fries? Oui. Okay. Uh, and l'eau est bon. L'eau est bon. Oui. C'était super. Je suis une vache. So now, as I head up to uh, Digne, starting to uh, follow the route that Napoleon took after his exile, here's a nice little diagram of what happened. He was sent here, Elba, just because they got sick of him, I guess. And uh, anyway, he escaped and took a ship to Cannes. Nice was probably like right over here. But anyway, he walked and walked all the way up here. There's Castellan, and he made it to Grenoble along the way, like just meeting people. And uh, yeah, I guess he was pretty good at persuading them. So he had quite a crew by the time he got up to here. And then uh, I think he marched on to Paris and then uh, became ruler again, which is uh, quite the feat. We'll take that spirit with us as we uh, head north. Now I'm back on the state road. It's gonna head north here to Digne, looking at about 30 kilometers. So still cut quite a ways to go. It's like 2.20 in the afternoon. So I might just give her for a bit here. Okay. So State Row was a little too busy Saturday afternoon here. So detour up this mountain. <laughs> Didn't want to do it, but here we are. Quite a view. So uh, we're just gonna fly down the mountain here. Looks like it's gonna be downhill the rest of the day. And kind of that peak right there, that's where we're heading. Oh, there we go. Yeah, that peak there is Digne. Probably stay the night there, or there'll be something on the way. Let's find out. So I was just talking to a lovely couple up there. Just learned that the Tour de France came through here in 2016. It's been a good uh, 15 minutes. I'm still just flying downhill. Can't complain. 